Hey guys, Nikhil here from Home Banao. In this video, I wanted to show you how Frosted Vinyl is installed on glass and what are the advantages, disadvantages of using Frosted Vinyl, where it's supposed to be used, what would you expect the cost to be, and all these other information regarding Frosted Vinyl. So the first thing, as you can see, which the operator is doing, is he's basically making sure that the surface is ready for installation. So he's removing any sort of dust, particles, smudges, any additional, you know, small sticky items. He's removing it from the blade and just wiping the glass completely clean. Now the frosted vinyl, which we'll be installing on this, it has few very key advantages. The first thing is to get a normal frosted glass is very expensive. The way of glass is frosted is they take a plain piece of glass and they put it through a sandblast or an acid etching. So the problem with this is you can't control exactly the amount of frosting you want. You can't control the shape of frosting you want. Whereas when you use a frosted vinyl, you can actually have control over all these things. Now, if you see here, he's taken a piece of vinyl frosting and he's just aligning it on the glass. If you think about it, this is very similar to installing a screen protector on your phone. The difference being that over here, they are able to use soap water because obviously there's no electronics behind the glass to worry about. To ensure that there's no air bubbles and to ensure a smooth installation is done. Now frosted vinyl, it has few advantages. One is if you're using it in your offices, it can add a level of privacy. So he's just showing, you know, how difficult it is to see when even the his hand is behind the glass just a little bit. The second thing is frosted vinyl is fairly easy to install. So this entire installation, I have fast forwarded two times, but the entire installation for this curved glass, which is very difficult to do, was done in just 30 minutes. Next, one more advantage is frosted vinyl is available in 100 feet rolls with 4 feet width. And the best part is, say you want to cut your company logo, that's possible. Say you want to print some material and then get this installed as a single piece. That is also possible. The cool part is, say in your house, you're getting a lot of sunlight. You do want some amount of sunlight, but you don't want the amount of heat which is coming. You can just put a frosted glass where what will happen is the sunlight will still come, but it won't come to a level where it is increasing the heat in your home. Now, one of the key things while maintaining and ensuring this installation to make sure it's perfect is that the air bubbles have to be completely removed. So if you see here, he's using a, a technique where he's applying some amount of heat on the vinyl and removing the air bubbles. This is again very similar to how we install a screen protector in our smartphone. So this is why you ensure that the glass is completely treated before you're installing the frosted vinyl. Now normally, Now, when you go to buy frosted vinyl in the market, you can get the installation done for anywhere between 120 rupees per square feet to 300, 350 rupees per square feet. Now you may ask, okay, what's the difference between the 120 rupees per square feet and the 300, 320 rupees per square feet vinyl? The difference is simple. If you're taking the premium one, you're gonna, the, the companies uh, of which the frosted vinyl will be installed will be 3M. And 3M makes the best frosted vinyl. So what do I mean by the best frosted vinyl? The best frosted vinyl is generally more scratch resistant. It's easier to install. There's no chance of any, even if you have smudges or fingerprints on it, it can be very easily wiped clean. The adhesive will be very strong. So over here, what you're seeing is sort of a mediocre grade material, not from 3M, but from a competitor. This one is about 200, 220 rupees per square feet installation. So even if someone is giving you at a lower cost, just ask them which grade or which company's material they are using because very unlikely that someone is going to do a 3M installation for such a low cost. So just keep that one thing in mind. Uh, which one should you do? Well, if you're just putting it for a simple commercial project, which you don't want to, which you don't think will last you more than a year, two years, then I would say don't spend the additional money on 
going with the 3M1. But if you want the best of the best materials, which will last you very long time, you should invest in the 3M uh, vinyl frosting because they are the other ones who pioneered this particular material. Now, few more things. Uh, the installation of this is quite fast. The surface which on which this can be installed, the only requirement is it has to be completely fat, flat. So the adhesive is quite strong. It is able to stick on it. After the installation is completed, you'll have to let go of it for about 48 hours. Don't, you know, don't try to peel it or anything like that. So once it dries, it'll be very hard for you to peel. So the adhesive takes about 48 hours to completely stick with the smooth surface. Finally, should someone use it in their home? So you can actually use frosted glass in a very sparing manner. It can be used in your shower cabinets. It can be used as a glass protector to prevent extra heat from coming in. And of course, it is regularly used in offices to increase the privacy and all those things. So keep these couple of things in mind.